Hello YouTube, how's it going? One thing, one thing that I have a problem with that I'm trying to solve today, possibly, if I can, or at some time, is this. Okay, I have these chests here. Now I open one. I acquire a potion. I have one potion. Then I click the second one there. Yeah, all good, all right, all right. Now I have acquired two potions. I cannot click these anymore because they are opened and the treasure inside has been taken. So, but, but, but. Now if I do a quick save here, then I do a quick load instantly. I can now again and take the potion out of this chest and I can repeat this infinitely. I can again quick save. Now I would have my potions amount in items saved. Then I quick load and again I can I can benefit from this. I can cheat with this. I can there's basically there's an infinite potion um, glitch in my game. And I do have to fix that somehow. What I will do is that I, I will have these... I will basically have persistent items in the game. That when I save, it saves the state of these persistent items. And then when I load from the persistent data, it reads that these two particular uh, chests have been opened previously and um, should not give out potions anymore. So stay tuned, I guess. Maybe, maybe I will get this done or maybe I will give up and take studies on how to become a plumber or something. Okay, bye. No, 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 no. I think I cracked this. So, 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 so. No. Here we are. There, there we go. All potions picked up. And then, quick load. Okay, quick save. Quick load. They're picked up. Quit. New game. They're not picked up. Quick load. They're picked up. Yeah, so basically Every node now belongs to a global group of persistent items. Persistent. And um, every chest has a saving function, a loading function. It creates a file for itself, which is a unique ID. Yeah, I also created unique ID, which is a string, so they are, I can easily tell them apart from each other. Mm. Yeah, if it has previously saved um, data and uh, the game is loaded, it's not a new game, we load persistent data. And where we save the persistent data is in our save global save function here. Mm. Basically, in here we have save nodes is a node array. Mm. Save nodes node array consists of all nodes that are in a group persistent, belong in the group persistent. Yeah. Anyway, and then when we push save button. Mm, for every node that is in the save nodes array, it does save persistent data function, which the chest has here. That's it. Every chest now has its own JSON 
am Church and File. That's how I did it. It's not very complicated. It's actually pretty simple. Okay, I seem to be running into a problem in some occasions. Previously freed in an all instance. Okay, let's fix that. Okay, I added this. If node is not null, then save persistent data. Else print node is null. Mm, I suspect that this has something to do with... With... Um, like when... When the chest is far away and I cannot see it and it gets called, then maybe. It gets. the All of those chests don't get. called at. Uh, drawn at all. But then let's see if I open this one. I open this one. Then I do a. Quick save here, then a quick load. Yeah, they stay. Okay, where did I get? Where did I come from? Here. Let's go back. Let's go back. Back here. Open up this one. Let's open up this one. Let's quick save, quick load. What the frick? They reset. That's not how it's supposed to go. Quick save, quick load. Why do they, what the? Why do they reset? Okay, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I will keep on tinkering. Now I think I I cracked the issue. It was this one. Save notes get read get notes in group persistent. This needs to be in the save function, of course, duh. Because it doesn't keep in sync when it's in the ready function because the ready function is running a runtime why when as the um save save game function when when i run this command in the save game function it is run every time so the um so it gets updated it it's the variable save notes is up to date is it's, it's it's current. It's it's on. It's on board with the game, like, and it has all the nodes at that current time when I click the save game button. Oh, at least that's how I think it works. And now, when I run my game. It works every time. It doesn't 
it doesn't go into the yaks. I'm sorry, my save function doesn't yet um, register my rotation, so it changes the rotation every time I load the game. So bear with me. But this works, no issues. I have persistent items now. Yeehaw! Took me a while. But I was just stupid. Now it works. Yay. Bye.